What's up YouTube? I'm Chad. Welcome back to Allo. Before I get back to the anxiety videos I was talking about in my last video, I wanted to take a quick minute to do a video about the files that are created by the DJI drones. Uh, in particular, comparing the file that is created on the SD card itself to the one that's stored in your device that you're using to control, uh, the one that's running the app rather. because. Uh, that one actually stores a copy of your file on your phone or tablet, whatever you're using uh, for the DJI Go 4 app. Uh, but there is a difference between those two files and we're going to show you what that difference is coming up next. Okay, here we are with a side-by-side -side comparison of the two identical video files. The left one, as you can see from the little titles, the left one is directly from the SD card. The right one came from my phone from the DJI Go 4 application. Again, the app seems to record a backup copy of your video and also your pictures as you record but as you can see here there is definitely a difference between the two video files the one from the SD card um, is much clearer has a lot more detail the one on the right that is recorded from your phone will be a lot more blurry it'll be muddied and also uh, if you look at the grass the one in the one from the phone, it's the, that color in particular, it would seem, like flashes. It'll flash between lighter and darker colors of green. When I was playing that back from my phone, I thought maybe there was a setting or something I would have to change, but apparently it's just because of the fact that the video recorded on the phone is a lower quality. Initially, I was only using the video from the phone thinking it was an, an identical copy and as I've seen reported on the internet there is an issue with a lot of people being able to play back the video files directly from the SD card on their computers. The only reason I'm able to play it back here is because it's going through my video editing software. I tried playing it through every other just plain video player that I had and I couldn't get couldn't get it to work. Some of them would show the first uh, clip or, two, or the first frame or two and then freeze. Other ones wouldn't load the clip at all. And on one or two of them it actually crashed my whole computer. So I don't know what it is about the video files being created within the drone itself, but a lot of systems seem to have trouble playing them back. Luckily, my video editing software seems to be able to handle it. So that's about the only way I can really view it is through my video editing software and then creating uh, another video out of it. So if you have a DJI drone and you've been relying on the video that comes out of your device, like your phone or your tablet, then you're definitely missing out. Watching the video played back on our HD, our, our, our uh, UHD TV, even from the phone, it looks really good. Again, those little, the flashes in the grass in particular were really strange, but the video quality looked really good. Um, now that I'm able to see the video directly from the SD card, it's uh, quite a bit better. So if, you've, if you are in the same boat as me and you're relying on the video from your device that you're using in the controller, then you definitely want to upgrade to the video that's on the SD card within your drone. So while we're watching the last little bit of this video, I just want to remind you to please go ahead and like the video, leave a comment if you feel, share it, 
subscribe and enjoy the rest of this video and I will catch you all next time.